This is Giggles. Her register name is T he he. So hence the giggles. That's awesome. But um, she's an English Springer Spaniel. She is four years old. She is um, an AKC breed champion. She has gotten her championship. But she also uh, does a lot of what we call performance, agility, obedience, and things like that. Um, the breed itself is active. They are a sporting breed. They um, are what is called a flushing spaniel. And um, many different types of hunting dogs. With the flushing spaniel, they go out and if the birds are in bushes and things like that, they dive into the bush and flush them out so that they go up. So they have to be a breed that stays very close to a hunter. They can't just take off and, and go flush birds that they could never shoot because they're so far away. So they're taught to stay like 25 feet from you all different ways. And so because of that, they're a breed that's really attached. They, it's very hard to lose them because they just, that's in their instinct to stay close to you. Whereas Britneys, they run. Uh, a lot of the different retrievers and pointers, they just setters, they just take off running and then they stop when they find a bird and then you have to find your dog. These guys are close by. So they are a really neat uh, companion dog because they like to be with you. So um, they're a lot of fun, they're very active, but they do require, even though they're supposed to be shown naturally, they do require quite a bit of grooming. And so what I have done here is I've trimmed half of her this is what we call the show side, where they actually, the judge sees this side because you stand them up. So she has gotten her ears trimmed, her <laughs> face is all trimmed, her neck's all trimmed, her feet, and then all of this hair is, you just work with it, strip it, comb it, brush it, and try to get it to be really shiny and natural looking. And then we have the other side where you can see there's all this hair on her foot. Okay. And compared to the one that has been trimmed, there's a lot of hair on her ears. She has about three weeks of growth. They are a continual hair growing breed. Then they got the stuff on top, get a little funky hair with sticking up on top. Her, uh, she's got her whiskers that we trim off so you can see those. Or this side, it's totally smooth. And it just gives them a very clean, sleek look about them. And then, you know, we kind of got a mess going here. But then the other side is all trimmed and flat and much better looking. Their tails, the hair grows on their tail. This side I've cut it off. And then this side, this is all hanging down. So start to finish, if you stick one of them in a bathtub, bathe them, blow them all out, get them totally dry, trim them, you can spend three or four hours. And usually, rule of thumb is, if you're gonna to go to a dog show or she is going to a dog show in California in two weeks, you're about two or three haircuts away from really having them ready. You can't just all of a sudden throw them in a tub, trim them and take them because you're never gonna get this hair to really lay well. So although it doesn't look like a lot, of the dogs here, it's probably the most grooming. And I just kind of made a mistake when I picked this breed, think, not knowing that they needed to be trimmed so much. But 30 years later, I'm still trimming them. <laughs> so uh, they're just a, a very fun breed. Right, Giggles? Mm -hmm. You're a very good girl. Yes, you 